exercise D. Replace the highlighted words and phrases with suitable object pronouns. In this exercise, we replace the highlighted words with the object pronouns. Number one, the was settled. Shashank dropped the was onto the floor. So here the highlighted word is the was. So we replace this with the object pronoun. The sentence will become the was settled. Full stop. Shashank dropped it onto the floor. Full stop. Number two, I met Radhika today. Full stop. I met Radhika after five years. So here the noun we are repeating once again. Radhika. It's the name of a girl. So we use pronoun her. It's an uh, uh, it's an object pronoun. We have to use the object pronoun. So object pronoun for a girl is her. I met Radhika today. Full stop. I met her after five years. Full stop. Number three. We met Amina and Shreya at the mall today. I met Amina and Shreya at the theater yesterday. So here the highlighted words are Amina and Shreya. The object pronoun for these two are them. So the answer will be, the sentence will come. We met Amina and Shreya at the mall today. I met them at the theater yesterday. Number four. Where should I keep these books? Should I put these books on that table? These books. The highlighted word is these books. The answer will become where should I keep these books? Question mark. Should I put them on that table? So for these highlighted word that is the these books we use object pronoun them. Number five. Pratik and I are going to the restaurant. Do you want to come with Pratik and I? Here object is Pratik and I. So we use object pronoun for these two are them. Us. Pratik and I are going to the restaurant. Do you want to come with us? Because Pratik and I were the subject to the sentence. And the object pronoun that we use for these, these two words are us. Number six. Where are Mitali and Arjun? Have you seen Mitali and Arjun today? So Mitali and Arjun. We are talking about the so the subject that is the where are Mithali and Arjun. The subject is asking about the Mithali and Arjun. Have you seen? So the object for object pronoun for this one them. Answer will become where are Mithali and Arjun? Question mark. Have you seen them today? Question mark. Number seven. The latter is on the sofa. You are sitting on the latter. So in the first part of the sentence, the sent, uh, latter is on the sofa. So the latter is the subject or the Noun and you are sitting on the latter. So the object pronoun for this noun is it. The sentence will become the latter is on the sofa. You are sitting on it. Full stop. Number eight. Kapil is making a lot of noise. Full stop. Ask Kapil to be quiet. So here the subject is Kapil and again we are using Kapil as a object. Uh, object pronoun. Object pronoun for the Kapil is him because it's a boy Kapil is making a lot of noise full stop ask him to be quiet full stop now exercise e choose the correct option number one dash me oblique i bracket close am the fastest runner in school so here me is an uh, object pronoun so here as the uh, the dash is in the starting of the sentence we use the subject pronoun and i is the subject pronoun so write i you must inform dash when you reach home. So op options are us and we. As we all know that we is a subject pronoun and us is an object pronoun. As the dash is in the middle of the sentence, we use us the object pronoun. So write us. Number three. Dash are very clever boy. So the answer is you. Number four. Climbing mountain Ab Mount Everest is difficult as dash is very high. The answer is it. Number five. I am sure that dash will meet me today. Again, the dash is in the middle of the sentence. So we use object pronoun and the object pronoun is he. Please tell dash to return my book. So here 
the object pronoun is her write down answer number 7 please ask dash if they will meet me now the answer is them 8 dash are waiting at the station so here write down they number 9 dash is a very helpful girl so here the, the dash is in the starting of sentence so we will use subject pronoun and here from these to the subject pronoun is she so write down she number 10 i received a beautiful gift full stop dash is a colorful scarf so here it p i uh, as it's a singular colorful scarf and they is used for plural now answer is it it so student do exercise a in your notebook and rest of the exercise like b c d e do all these exercise in your book thank you